Hey guys, you got the land crawler here, and we're on uh, 83.5 acres, Heard County, Georgia. 1.5 acres of that is over in Alabama, but right on the Georgia-Alabama line. So we've got good paved road uh, frontage, highway frontage. Uh, we've got power. Got a little nice little lake on this. Let's go. I'm gonna take you right in, and let's take a, a run right into the front part of the property here. <clears throat> First thing we're going to go by is a nice little lake. Uh, you know, it's probably, it's right here at the road. Um, you know, it's probably half to three quarters of an acre. So uh, we've got a, a pretty little lake here uh, right on the property, right off the road. Uh, seller's just coming back from throwing his line in a couple times. So you got the pretty lake right there. We've got good internal road system. And uh, the front part here has been uh, thinned out. Uh, they left a lot of the big trees in here, but it's been nicely thinned. Actually, it looks to me like some really good rabbit and quail uh, country here. But as you come in the front, now <clears throat> there are several structures on the property. Uh, a gentleman did start this uh, years ago and, and unfortunately passed away. Uh, sort of after starting it, but there's some real nice uh, foundational and stone type work here. Uh, this was going to be a little cabin, and just look at that. There's some beautiful stone work there. A lot of quartz I'm seeing in that stone. And uh, over here we've got a nice little pole barn. I'm gonna, let's get out and take a look at these structures. Let me walk you through these uh, structures real quick. Now the property does have already on it a well and a septic system and a good start here on a cabin. So for you do-it-yourselfers, look at this, uh, there's some really, really nice stonework here uh, on this uh, starter cabin. A lot of, I'm seeing a lot of strong, good, good quartz in there on that. And let's go on in here real quick. And then you've got your pole barn over there. The gentleman put a lot of work in this. Unfortunately, wasn't able to finish it. <laughs> a nice little hangout here. Uh, you can see the start of the fireplace here. Beautiful quartz. I really like that quartz. Uh, gosh, this, you know, for you handy guys that... Uh, Looks like some really pretty good, I'm no construction expert, but uh, looks pretty strong. And this would be great. This what a, what a start on something though. You know, hey, this, this price per acre is like raw land pricing. But you've got a really good start on this, uh, on, on this structure here. That's a great start on that. Well and septic's already in. You've got power is run up here. There's your power line. Run up here to the partially completed cabin. There's the beast. The beast gets us around all these places. Um, all these big trees are on the property here. And look at this pole barn. Real nice pole barn. Storage area here. Covered storage. I can tell you from experience. Really good to have this kind of Nice sliding door here, and great storage area for your equipment. Tractor and all in here. Looks like a nice cedar, old cedar post there. And some big, big woods. If you see some, uh, the blue markings, that's not the property line by any stretch. That's just some, uh, uh, for the uh, thinning operation that was on here. Look at the big woods here. Got deer and turkey out here, guys. Okay, guys, I'm just beyond the uh, where the cabin was started and the, and the uh, pole barn. And here we've got the well that's in place. A uh, new pump has been put in here uh, about a year ago. And look at the big pine in here, guys. Big, big pine. Uh, now, right down here, what you're looking at here in the distance, beautiful, beautiful hardwood drain. There's a beautiful creek down there. We can go take a look here in a minute. But... Uh, Got a beautiful hardwood drain there and some, you know, some really nice open fields here with some big trees scattered all around. And again, I love, uh, you may have heard if you've seen some of my videos, I just love stonework. And uh, 
I look at this little barbecue pit, picnic area here. Man put a lot of work in that, that stone right there. That's a, some beautiful stone work right there. And so you got a nice little, again, great start here on a little picnic area. It's all nice bricks here. You know, a uh, little barbecue pit here. And uh, looking down over the creek, look at that. Down there is your creek, creek bottom. And look at these beautiful hardwoods. Big, big, beautiful hardwoods down here in this creek bottom. Now there's some potential lake sites down in there that would be, you know, perfect for a, a lake down in there. And you could you could rebuild maybe here overlooking a pond or something. A little picnic area there, beautiful. Hey guys, this is a beautiful little knoll here, a little shoulder, and look at this, the big big hardwoods and all, and drops right down to the creek. I'm right here overlooking the creek. Look at that little run right here. I'm gonna try to be quiet. Maybe you can hear it. Beautiful little bedrock, big boulder there, a little run right there in the creek bottom. And as you can tell, you've got some big, big hardwoods. Hey, deer hunters, there's all kind of white oaks in here. All kind of acorns being dropped in here. And uh, here's a beautiful little creek running right through the middle of the property on both sides. Of course, this is right in the middle of the property. Kind of in the front third, if you will. And uh, yeah, we're you've got about... 66% of the property we haven't even been to yet, but uh, got some potential lake sites right here and got some big, 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 big hardwoods in here in this bottom. I'll give you a little 360 here, guys. There's the, you can see the pole barn and the partial barn in the distance, and I'm just stepped into the woods a little bit. That's the old picnic area. The, you saw an old outhouse there, and uh, look at these uh, this hardwood bottom. Again, I'm looking over that creek bottom. Guys, this place is really convenient, right on the Georgia-Alabama border, on the way to uh, Highway 34, not far from LaGrange, not far from Roanoke, Alabama. Great location. Look at these big trees in here. There's a little 360. I'm on another shoulder location overlooking the creek. There's some big, big white oaks in here, guys, if you're a deer hunter. Uh, a lot of white oak. And look at that creek bottom down in there. Now, bottoms are one of the best places to hunt big deer, as you know. And this has some, boy, this is going to have some acorn drops in the fall, I'll tell you that. Another little 360. Real nice view here, guys. I'm kind of overlooking the lake here. That's a real nice view of the lake down there. A lot of big hardwood and pine up here, too, guys. Really nice. Hey guys, here you go. You got a little bit of a, a creek bottom here below the dam. And, uh, you know, the, 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 uh, the line's another hundred yards in there, so all this bottom here is also on the property. But hey, gonna put a wrap. I'm uh, I'm standing on the dam. Here's a little, you know, three quarter acre uh, pond, lake, uh, stocked, bass and crappie. Um, good road system in, and you see the power run into the uh, the structures we talked about. There's the partial cabin, etc. But uh, hey, guys, 83.5 acres, Heard County, Georgia. There's 1.5 acres in Alabama. Um, and uh, nice little lake here, beautiful big hardwoods all over the place. Good location, guys. Call the land crawler, 770-424-5800. Come take a look at this one. And bring your fishing pole.